Hey everyone, welcome to another um, training on activities to make your life a little bit easier. So, one of the things that students um, often do is enter their service hours, and we're going to show you how to do that. Um, this will probably be like take 14, so let's go. So, if you go to your um, the activities home page for your department, club, or org, you'll see something that says service hours like right here. Just click on that. And you'll be able to see the number of service hours you've completed um, for the academic year, for the month, week, or you can custom the time period to see how many you've completed, like say within two years. Um, right now, this student group has not completed any service hours um, that I know of, which have been submitted. So we don't see anything there. Um, in addition to that, it will also show you whether those service hours have been um, approved or not, whether it's still pending review. So if you want to enter your service hours, there are two ways you can do that. You can either go to add service hours right here, or if you click manage service hours, you can add service hours as well. So we're going to do that. And then you would have to enter the name of the student who was um, part of the group that completed the service hours. So we're going to put my name because it's convenient. And then we're just going to write a quick description because this is a test. I'm just going to um, write test. Test and system. Um, we're going to select date and you have to enter the service hours in um, hours and minutes so let's say one hour and fifteen minutes and enter the organization you did it with so I'm going to put in Office of Student Involvement and Leadership and go to create so now it tells you that for this week of August 6th to August 13th um, 1.15 one hour and 15 minutes of approved service hours have been entered. Um, the reason they automatically approved is because I am an administrator, but if you are a student, um, you won't have that same privilege, so just be aware of that. Um, if you do not want these service hours to be listed here anymore, you can also delete that by simply clicking within the box and then click the word delete selected. And it will delete that for you. Um, if you want to view those service hours, you can click on view over here and it'll tell you date, time, the description of those service hours and so forth. Alright, so I'm, I'm going to delete that. And that's everything you need to know on service hours. Let me know if you guys have any questions. Bye!